Good morning everyone. I am Dr. B. Nagarjuna, Associate Professor, Sri Vidya Niketan Institute of Management, Tirupati. Uh, at the outset, uh, I, I have been asked by the coordinators of this NPTEL program to give feedback on the ongoing NPTEL uh, examinations, uh, January-December 2020 session. Uh, you can observe here right uh, what to call uh, the flow of the students right this moment they, are, uh, they have completed the examination and they are uh, leaving the examination hall. So this clearly shows that uh, how much uh, 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 what to call uh, interested are the students to uh, undergo these courses uh, particularly because uh, uh, it is very rare opportunity for uh, uh, people to get uh, into uh, IITs. Uh, what to call uh, in the prestigious Indian Institute of Technologies and uh, uh, get certification from them. So for those who have missed the opportunity of uh, studying in uh, IITs, so this NPTEL programs will be a very good platform uh, to pursue the courses and get the certifications from IITs. That is one uh, uh, what to call uh, a great advantage uh, which I personally feel because uh, we are deprived of uh, uh, studying in Indian Institute of Technology for various reasons. The second thing is uh, these programs uh, which have been actively what to call uh, initiated by the Ministry of Human Resource Development Government of India across the country uh, have been definitely they have uh, designed the course in such a way to meet the industry needs because unfortunately what is happening in most of the institutes in uh, our uh, what to call uh, curriculum is uh, we are not able to match the academics with the industry, which is very much important. What we study is something different. What industry requires is something different. So these NPTEL programs are uh, the uh, course structure, the syllabus, the videos, the lecture, uh, what to call uh, uh, lectures delivered by the expert professors or in such a way, uh, keeping in view the, what the industry right now is demanding. So definitely, People uh, uh, along with uh, the certifications what they get from prestigious Indian Institute of Technology, definitely uh, they will be in a position to uh, grab the various opportunities in various uh, contemporary developments that are taking place in the industry uh, like uh, cloud computing, artificial intelligence, machine learning, internet of things and uh, in, in different disciplines right? not related to specific area because uh, uh, as you know, right, the 2021 session of NPTEL is already announced, which is going to start in January 2021. Uh, 500 plus courses are being introduced uh, in the 2021 session, covering the various disciplines, uh, meeting the requirements of industry, uh, and also the interests of various students pursuing different courses uh, uh, in different streams. So personally, uh, if it comes to me, right, uh, specifically, uh, uh, I have completed so far uh, uh, nine what to call courses in uh, uh, NPTEL uh, so far uh, uh, in the uh, completed sessions in 2018 and 19 and uh, I, I feel proud to say that I have uh, enrolled for uh, uh, 10 courses this time right in 2020 because uh, in January uh, April session I have enrolled for four courses and uh, July December session I have enrolled for six courses and uh, because of this COVID-19 and uh, uh, the lockdown uh, uh, that happened in the country the uh, uh, what to call examination that were supposed to be conducted in May 2020 were postponed and all the 10 courses uh, uh, what to call I have come I, I am prepared to attend in this uh, uh, five days right uh, from 17th of uh, this month I have been attending uh, this is the third day and this is the fifth course, fifth exam which I have written. Again in the afternoon I have to come and I have to take a one more examination. Tomorrow two more examinations and Monday, uh, 21st uh, December I, I am expected to take a remote proctored examinations. In spite of because I am already what to call uh, uh, 45 uh, what to call uh, years and I am working in a very good uh, position in a reputed institute also and I am a doctorate holder also. But still, uh, I am very much passionate to uh, take up this course just like young students uh, seen here uh, because age is not a factor for uh, learning, right? Because a lot of changes are taking place uh, uh, in the what to call industry. And I am basically from management background, uh, basically an engineer. 
with B.Tech in Civil Engineering, uh, MBA from Bangalore University and a PhD from Sri Venkateshwara University uh, with over two decades of experience in teaching. Uh, right now I am working at Sri Vidyaniketan Institute of Management, Tirupati, uh, run by uh, prestigious uh, uh, veteran, uh, uh, what to call uh, actor, Dr. Padmasri, Dr. Mohan Babgaru. And with all his blessings, uh, I was permitted to what to call attend all these examinations. And I am uh, successfully uh, able to handle all the examinations. And I am very happy that uh, NPTEL is really helping me uh, both uh, professionally and also in gaining knowledge. I wish uh, great success uh, for the NPTEL coordinators in the coming days also and uh, come out with uh, all new courses that will really help the students to meet uh, the industry needs. Thank you very much. Hi, my name is B. Ravi Babu. I am doing associate professor in department of ECE. So my, I am uh, working in uh, Siddharth Institute of Engineering Technology. So this semester I was uh, opted an introduction to coding theory. So this is a subject, new subject for me because uh, I have handled many subjects but related uh, this uh, linear coding systems I have very much interested so that I was opted this subject. So uh, when I was gone through that uh, internal assignments it was very interesting and I opted in, uh, different uh, subjects also. That was in the previous semester I was opted uh, antennas and wave propagation then uh, I done uh, I, I came to this uh, uh, examination point of view, then I was uh, achieved certificate also and that, thereafter introduction uh, to inter internet of things also I was achieved certificate. So these are a good experience to me uh, past uh, 7 years. Okay, I was uh, joined in 2012 in uh, one of the college. So on that time uh, the, this course came to my experience. So uh, thereafter uh, it, it's uh, useful to me. So I was uh, Many examinations uh, participated, so with the help of these courses, it's a very full, uh, very full useful to me because uh, um, the all the courses uh, videos has been downloaded uh, from the respect to NPTEL videos. So I watched all the videos every semester, so that it's very, very useful for me. And as well as you uh, uh, know, IITs and uh, uh, NITs only, these courses will be established. But now these courses all courses are brought to the uh, engineering colleges also. So every student has to utilize this opportunity. So because of they need to grow the knowledge. So with the help of knowledge they can uh, competitive exams, they will facing the competitive exams and as well as uh, they are going to useful for get exams also. So in my uh, experience, I have a uh, very good experience in this uh, uh, platform and definitely in future also I will uh, more subjects will be up in this experience. Thank you very much. My name is Jahnavi. SV University, Electronics and Communication Engineering. As it is used to calculate some mathematical calculations, so that's why it's very useful. And I also have Java programming, so it is useful in coding also. Yeah, we are performing assignments for every week by viewing the videos. Okay. Yes, the lectures are very useful and uh, they are flexible, so we can no get knowledge about the MATLAB and different courses, whatever we want. Okay. So yeah, we have learned the basics. Okay. Uh, it is better to take the course who are interested in what courses. So if you are interested in programming course, then you have to take programming, otherwise other courses. There are lot of many courses, so you can choose anyone which is helpful to yourself. Sri Vatsava, MATLAB. MATLAB. Programming. It is a very good experience. It gives us a lot of knowledge. It gives us mainly experience. I like NPT. Assignment questions are not that very difficult. Okay. You can, by listening to the lectures, we can easily attempt those assignment questions. By attempting those questions, we can clearly crack this NBTL exam. I can say that I can greatly improve in MATLAB after taking this course. Apart from the daily syllabus or curriculum, NBTL courses will definitely help in their further studies. They will give some more knowledge. So I suggest every student to take some, some courses other than their academics so that it, it will help their job interviews. Okay, thank you. Yeah, my name is Dr. S.K. Aling. I am presently doing my post graduation in orthopedics in Narayana Medical College. So it will be helpful for me in doing any publication or any thesis or any article or any further research in my career going, uh, going forwards. Yeah, I have done everything uh, with my own uh, after watching the lectures and after doing the assignment I have got some clarity in that and it was pretty helpful for me in uh, performing today. Okay. 
uh, if uh, if you ask me before the course i was uh, like 25 to 50% now i am pretty good up to 80 to 90% oh. yeah nothing much they are do you are doing pretty good my name is aishwarya sv university second year solar energy engineering and technology it is like completely somewhat uh, formula based uh, subject i feel like that mostly you have to remember the formulas and application is small part in that uh, out of 15 questions uh, we can do 13 12 questions from the problems which are solved in the video lectures uh, two questions just some twist or in difficulty some feeling i didn't write any question i just uh, see the questions who are asked by my friends or uh, members in that course mostly all the questions are in the assignment only my name is shrujana i took uh, german one yeah it's really so good that uh, i've learned lot of things um, and i i think so it's uh, i can do i mean i did very well regarding that so i'm from pondicherry engineering college oh, pondicherry no no uh, we don't have any foreign uh, languages so uh, the only thing uh, foreign language which i found in nptel is german and at first i thought i was little bit afraid to take that but uh, once i started doing the course i really felt it's so good and uh, um, it's it's really very good and even the teacher i mean the professor who used to take the classes he explained uh, everything very so detailed and it was really so good well um, maybe after german two part okay right now i can understand the entire uh, german thing if uh, someone speaks to me in german so maybe i may not speak to them in uh, as a response but still i can understand them there are lot of uh, options regarding in, in nptel so it's not only for students everyone can take up these courses uh, there are some hundreds and hundreds of courses uh, so if any if in any field if you are interested and if it's not provided within in, uh, in your college you can surely uh, take this course and it's really very helpful they give very detailed and complete explanation maybe around uh, 80 to 90% okay very good thank you thank you uh, my name is dheeraja i am bindu we are from shastra university uh, we took german uh, one okay it was good and it was very new experience as we did not go through uh, any international language yet so definitely this is going to be a good start we feel yeah it was a good experience learning the new language uh, the reason behind choosing is german is we have that zeal to learn the new languages it is very useful while learning those so uh, the main thing is we have to go through each and every video to complete the exam in a good manner and score good marks and continuing with the german 2 and german 3 which would be much better for uh, getting the complete knowledge of the language and the course definitely if we want to go and work in uh, some international uh, companies. countries or companies we have to definitely uh, survive there for at least uh, two or three months so in order to have good communication with the people around we definitely uh, have this usage I think many of the NPTEL courses students just prepare f about the assignment questions and come but uh, uh, for this exam this is completely different each and every student have to go through the entire videos uh, and uh, I am sure that no question will be given from the assignment itself you will not even pass if you do that so I suggest everyone to go through the videos and uh, have the complete knowledge before coming to the exam thank you thank you, uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My, my good name is uh, Siva Ganesh. Uh, I took the German one course, which is taught by Dr. Milind Brahme from IIT Madras. I am from Sastra University in Tanjavur. Uh, our college doesn't offer any foreign courses, so uh, that's why I took uh, German one in NPTEL, and uh, which was very helpful to me. Uh, I would like to give like Spanish, French. Spanish, French and Italian because those are very popular and I think uh, those languages are not available in NBTL. So it would be very good uh, if you implement those languages in NBTL. Thank we say you. in English, thank you, Danka, uh, good morning, Herzlich Willkommen. Charita, uh, I'm from Shasta University and studying EC third year, scientific, uh, math, scientific computation using MATLAB.
Uh, actually, I took the course, uh, uh, I mean, to gain some knowledge on MATLAB. And actually, it is based on um, uh, mathematics behind uh, everything. So, we'll be able to know about uh, iterative formulas and uh, easy solutions to find roots of uh, simultaneous equations. Yeah, now I can, I'm, I'm able to solve them, uh, I mean, I'm able to solve any complex uh, equations easily using the tricks uh, told in MATLAB now. Before and all, I'm not aware of the tricks. Any suggestions to... It would be better if they want to know about uh, maths behind every form, I mean, maths behind everything. So, yeah. Yeah, if you are thorough with assignments and um, if you are thorough with all the models taught, then we can easily write it. Okay, yeah, okay. but we need to practice a bit. No, but uh, in this year alone, I have registered for some other courses. Okay, okay. Charita, uh, SVC Tirupati. Uh, I finished civil engineering. Uh, I've taken environmental chemistry and integrated waste management. And uh, they're helpful uh, because I want to make a career in environmental engineering. Yeah, they're pretty interesting. And uh, it, the question paper as such was very challenging. Um, I'll have to wait and see how it'll turn out. Uh, yeah, assignments are good for learning every week so that we don't postpone it towards the end. And uh, they make us think. If we can pursue uh, the courses we like which are uh, not in our curriculum as such so that we can uh, try out specializations for the future. Yeah, yeah, I've asked a couple of doubts I had in the assignment. A couple of times it was late. Okay. But otherwise, yeah, I got the answers for okay. them. Uh, no, actually in the for, uh, in the course I did, there was no uh, external questions or anything of the sort. They were just discussing the ones from the assignment. Indira Ondrakunda. I did the Google Google Cloud Foundation course. I am from SC Venkatesar University College of Engineering. I am from Computer Science Department. Finally a BTEC. Uh, actually I already did the machine learning course uh, and when I was in first year. Now I choose to do the Google Cloud Computing course. At present the world, uh, the m most of the data is managing using a cloud computing only. So that's why I used this, I use, selected this course to do. Uh, I, got, uh, I got 22 in my assignments of 25. Uh, when we follow the lectures and we, we do the assignments and it is easy to understand and we can get the good score also. Almost 5 to 6 members of my classmates selected this Google Cloud Computing course. Okay. Actually Cloud Computing is also there and Google Cloud Computing is also available. But uh, uh, Google Cloud Computing I was chosen because uh, the world data it has the largest computing set so that's why I chosen this. Uh, my name is Deepti. I am from Veltech. Uh Rangra, uh, Veltech Institute of uh, Doctor uh, Science and Technology Institute of Science and Technology in Chennai, and uh, I took uh, the joy of computing using Python. Yeah, it is very helpful, and uh, I learned I learned lot of uh, um, in Python, lot of uh, experience in Python. Yeah, uh, uh, I studied um, uh, lot in Python and. Uh, I cleared my doubts what I faced uh, when I'm studying uh, when when I'm studying in uh, college, and I cleared all my doubts uh, by doing this course. Okay. Yeah. Uh, if if you listen our uh, courses, that is uh, what lecturers will say, then it will be easy for us. Mm. If you if you are not able to listen their classes, means uh, it will be little tough, mm. but we can um, we can attempt okay. by listening that courses only. Uh, they help a lot to us. Mm. Yeah, these NPTEL courses will help for us to learn uh, these uh, programming languages as uh, in uh, C or C++ or is Java, Python. I took this Python, but these will be helpful a lot uh, if you if you are interested in learning uh, programming languages. My name is Harshita and her name is Dikshita. Uh, we are from SV University College of Engineering. We are third year now. I took Python and she took. I took switching circuits and logic design. Okay. So how it, how it Actually, uh, to go to the software side, the Python is very helpful to us. So, I took that. About uh, switching, lo switching circuits and logic design is about uh, circuits, how to design the logic gates. It is very useful okay. for even... So, assignments no. are uh, better, but exam is somewhat too tough, I think. Assignments, exam is too tough. This course is very excellent, they are saying awesome. Um, I will advise that uh, to take NPTEL course if uh, any, any doubts is there in any subjects. 
Yeah, it's mandatory for we us. And there are some credits also for this. Still we have to take. That's saying very awesome. Okay. Each and every topic that is saying very clearly. Uh, myself, Dr. Vaibhav Nasre. I am from Swims uh, Hospital, Tirupati. I have registered this uh, course for uh, my academic uh, purposes. Uh, information provided on the NPTEL certificate was uh, very good. Uh, regarding center also, I easily get everything information. I was getting regular emails and everything on my registered email ID. Uh, all the assignment uh, which uh, they have given was very good for preparation purpose also. All videos are very helpful uh, uh, for the preparation of the exam. Center location was also easily accessible. Uh, staff was very supportive. I didn't face any difficulty for localization of the center. And uh, all guidelines are already given. So overall my experience with the NPTEL was very good. Assignment was very good. Whatever assignment uh, they have given as a preparation guide, it was very much helpful. Uh, if you revise that whole assignment, exam uh, question was from that assignment only. So if you go through that assignment, it is helpful for uh, your scoring also. So whatever the study material they have provided was very good. It was helpful only. Myself, Dr. Ashish from uh, Sims Tirupati. I am doing MCH Urology course. I have applied for this uh, research methodology course and uh, I came here. The assignments were uh, uh, good. And uh, questions were very good and uh, we, we did our assignment uh, after reading the uh, matter and uh, seeing the videos uh, and exam was, was here also it was very good and uh, questions were tough and uh, easy also. It was a mixed paper and uh, my experience was very good. I am Dr. Sharda, General Surgeon from SVR Rhea Hospital, Tirupati. Uh, it will be here. generally useful We are the staff here. It will be generally useful as we are the guides of the postgraduate students. We have, to, we have to know some things also, the rules and regulations. Then we can guide them very properly. It will be very useful for the postgraduate students, okay. I think, okay. Okay. Uh, for completion of their thesis work. It is a good idea. Very no, good no, this, this will be useful for uh, thesis purpose so mainly thesis purpose. for submission. Without submitting the thesis, they okay. can't go they for the exam, they can't be completed. Okay. And it is very useful for as guides also. Okay. Thank you. For, for us also. Siddhartha okay. Institute College. Okay. Jay Prakash and Jyotish. Jaya of Computer Python. Actually, we did it for our college reputation, sir. They said two, two courses are mandatory. So we have taken one, one for this year and we are going to take another for another year. Actually, first of all, we are taking this course. We felt uh, very fierce, sir. Oh, all are telling Python is very tough. Python, you know, Python is very tough to learn. And there is a good job for Python. There is good jobs for Python if you learn. But after choosing this course and attending for two to three weeks, we really enjoyed well, sir. The person who is taking this is uh, SR Iyengar, sir. Yes, sir. We are feeling much better now, sir. We know some basics how, uh, anyhow. And uh, we want to finish it uh, after all the exam also, sir. It means we did not study fully, but uh, now, if there is a time, we, we want to finish it, sir. Actually, JF computing using Python is very b basic course, this is one. Uh, when compared to the um, Python in data sciences, Python, JF computing using Python is very basic and we really enjoyed. Surinarayana. I am studying from uh, SV University, Tirupati and I am doing uh, NPTEL Java, Java programming Java course. Actually only uh, C language is offered okay. but uh, Java and other language as I am from uh, EC department okay. so our course are not so programming really languages okay. oh, so that's why only they offered uh, C programming so Java they didn't offer. Actually this Java I am um, this Java programming is actually nowadays uh, whole world is running uh, uh, around software. So this Java is uh, useful for not only CSE but uh, whole other branches also, non-core branches. Actually, I felt 70% uh, of assignments are from the lectures what we heard. They will ask little uh, advanced questions also, means a lip deep or in a head concepts also. So that student means I felt the uh, I felt that students may. Uh, Implicitly uh, go ahead and uh, they will uh, uh, read the concept. So that's why I felt that 
they were giving assignments sir uh, like 70 percent we are able to do by seeing or watching uh, uh, that week, particular week videos and remaining 30 percent or 20 10 percent will be in ahead concepts so that we uh, students can proactively uh, access the subject and they, they may get interest to um, go further even before teacher uh, say so nowadays the major problem in colleges uh, everyone facing uh, like attendance they have to go college and they have to do means they don't have any uh, flexible timings to uh, attend classes means whenever the college period is there they have to go and attend the same with in the same timing but uh, uh, I, of course um, every student every student may not uh, attend the same class uh, whatever the time they had given in the college but this NPTEL courses as a first we can say it is flexible whenever in a whole day whenever we want to do uh, whenever we want to see the video and uh, learn we can learn and that too only half an hour it is so it is uh, it will take only little time we will easily spend and it is like a uh, five day courses it is uh, very Sh comfortable short term, uh, short -term courses, courses. Okay. but it, it gives good knowledge and uh, good knowledge means they will uh, give as a whole uh, IIT professors so they will give uh, very good concept uh, actually I only know uh, C programming uh, which was taught in my college but this in after uh, coming to Java this is object object oriented programming but I, I means I have confidence that in uh, if they give any Java program I can do it uh, with an efficiency of 70 percent or 80 percent I can easily okay, do easy but, to the, up the, to 70 percent okay, previously I don't uh, have any knowledge in Java but okay. now I can I have that confidence that, that I can do. Thank you, sir. Yeah, I'm Charishma. I'm from Shastra University, Tanjore, and I'm, I did my course on ecology and society as my open elective. The first one, compared to other online courses, uh, and this one is more comfortable for us. And also, as this is uh, from the government, I think uh, the certificate is more valuable compared to others. And, and our also, and our college also, recommended this uh, NPTEL, so we chose that. Yeah, assignments were very, uh, not so easy but not difficult either. If you listen to lectures correctly, we can answer them. That's not a big deal. So it's actually a good course. Uh, if you want to learn something apart from your core subjects, it's very useful. And as to ace the exam, you should compulsory listen to lectures very carefully. There are a few points that we have chance to miss, so we should listen to class. I mean, like classes very carefully. My name is Pradeep Kumar Gaud, Ediga. Sir, I am from SU University, fourth year. I am about to come fourth year. Okay. And I have chosen the course Embedded System, and okay. it is most helpful for me. By as I have recently graduated my VLSI programming lab, and it is most helpful for me to doing in programs and uh, and I've been knowing about the IC information and also about the information regarding the how to perform the fabrication process regarding etc regarding the VLSA lab communication subject so i have chosen that I, it will be very much helpful for me when i am going to the VLSA related fields yeah, and it will be very good for me for getting doing my if i, if I am interested in further studies it will be most helpful for me in doing mtech for uh, choosing this kind of subject the I mean, assignments and the class and the assignments and the pro professors are also most helpful for the giving information to the people. The assignments are most helpful for the examination. Yes, sir, I have, cho I have chosen I IOT also, okay, but I have not written that exam. After getting this result, I okay. choose the another exam for the for the future. Thank you, sir. My name is Shiva. Actually, I am from Chandigarh University. I was doing artificial intelligence and machine learning. Practical machine learning with TensorFlow. Okay. Actually, uh, everybody knows that the TensorFlow is used by Google and it's, in, and it's most uh, used API uh, till now uh, Google has been introduced. So I hope so that the certificate and the future, uh, future scope will be very high using this TensorFlow courses. And even the NPTEL courses as well. Uh, yeah, assignments were really tough. Uh, we, we cannot get the answers in Google as well. I, that's that's really a challenging assignments. But the assignments, we, if we just follow the courses as well, I mean like the videos regularly, then we can really do, easy, do it is very easy. The knowledge I get was really awesome. Uh, the, the faculty was 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 was, was, uh, was from uh, Google and uh, and he he really taught well. 
Actually, I got pretty confident. Uh, more than 90, 95% confidence I got. I, can, I was really confident that I can really uh, crack any exam uh, when, when connected with the tense of Yes, I have took uh, three courses. Uh, one is from Artificial Intelligence Problem Solving and uh, Java Spring APIs. Of course, yes, uh, you can get more skills uh, when, when, when you take these kind of courses and uh, improve your skills and uh, whenever it feels like a com companies were asking, so that you can really crack the exam as well. Divya Shri, Sri Venkateshwara University College of Engineering, oh. second year, uh, Constitution of India and to learn everything uh, what is going on, going on in our society and for uh, academic uh, so I choose that. Okay. Little bit tough but uh, if we listen all the lectures in that clearly we can do it very well. Just watch all the lecture videos clearly and understand them uh, without leaving them. Please listen carefully all the um, lecture videos. Okay. Sir, my name is Rajesh. I am working as a faculty in uh, New Horizon College of Engineering, Bangalore. So I have uh, undergone this introduction to embedded systems. So curriculum will be more of a theoretical one, whereas this one is a practical hands-on experience with a programming knowledge. Here, uh, introduction to embedded systems. No, not KLC exactly. Uh, Eagle, Eagle board, okay. fabrication of the board, MSP 430, okay. everything we have done. So Assignments, uh, it's moderate. I can't say it is an easy and it is a uh, uh, toughest one. When coming to the analysis part, it is the toughest. And uh, coming to analyzation uh, of any circuit, that is fine. Yeah, I have chosen, but I have done not done the exam. This is the first time I am doing the exam. So it's moderate. Moderate. Yeah, definitely. The, all the students who are uh, learning this uh, engineering courses, going through engineering courses, have to at least for uh, for one semester or one year, one course has to be taken by the students so that they can enhance their skills. So. Uh have you taken any, uh, sorry, you are taking any courses for January 21 section? Ah, yes sir, I have taken it. Okay. So, indeed, it's one of that is embedded system design, which, uh, which is an extension to my present course. Okay. Uh, Naveen, uh, Sri Rama Engineering College, okay. market research and analysis for the uh, marketing. The NBTL courses uh, is very difficult and uh, it provides more information. According the college information is given to me, but uh, this information is uh, wide. Uh, the NPTEL provides some assignments for us. Uh, if we learn more about uh, NPTEL, what they provide the information, uh, if we learn uh, the videos and uh, uh, information regarding that, uh, and uh, the assignments are uh, easy to fill. Okay. So that if we learn more, the assignment is uh, easy. Yeah. Otherwise, they are difficult to us. If the market analysis is, uh, uh, nowadays market is uh, uh, around the, our uh, environment, uh, the market research, we can find uh, more information in the market and we can suggest the uh, other, other persons to choose this market research for uh, such kind of information you got. If you uh, uh, take more information on this course, yeah, they are definitely choosing the NPTEL course for the uh, a future requirement uh, so uh, they can fulfill their uh, achievements to definitely choose the NPTEL courses for the better opportunities. Vishnu Sai, Sastra University, Tanjavur Degara, developing soft skills and personality. Uh, course is very interactive. Okay. Uh, I have to tell you about this course. I have to tell you about this course. I have to tell you about this course. I have to tell you about this Manam Samajam lo yellow melagachu, developing soft skills and personality. Manam Samajam lo yellow melagachu, Manam face a situations ni yellow yedru kochu, under to cultures yellow ondachu, yavurto yellow behave seyali, under to yellow matla dali, ane chala vishya lo manam mind manam yellow control jasko ali, situations ni yellow deal seyali, inka chala chala vishya lo. Present to na youth ki upyog pade bhi nanga chala chala bond hai. Certificate use hai achhi. Pratiyo ko job ki soft skills ani important hai. Mana skills mana magar fit kora mo le dhani chhu bichhan karna. Mana behavior lo a change. Mana behavior lo a change aur kani pisa aur automatic ga mani acquire change karna chance hontari. 
సో సర్టిఫికేట్ చూపించుకోవడం చూపించుకోవడం అనేది మ్యాటర్ కాదు మన బిహేవియర్లో చేంజ్ ఉండాలి తీసుకుంటాను చేస్తాను చేస్తాను దీనికి కంటిన్యూషన్గా ఇంకొక కోర్స్ ఉంది ఎన్హాన్సింగ్ ఈ కోర్స్ వచ్చి డెవలపింగ్ సాఫ్ట్ స్కిల్స్ అండ్ పర్సనాలిటీ నెక్స్ట్ కోర్స్ వచ్చి ఎన్హాన్సింగ్ సాఫ్ట్ స్కిల్స్ అండ్ పర్సనాలిటీ అంటే దాన్ని ఇంకా ఎలా డెవలప్ చేసుకోవచ్చు అనే దాని మీద ఉంటుంది ఆ కోర్సు సో దాన్ని తీసుకొని చేస్తాను నేను లొకేషన్ సిటీ అవుట్స్కర్ట్స్ కొద్దిగా సిటీలో ఉంటే కొద్దిగా అందరికీ కన్వీనియంట్గా ఉంటుంది లొకేషన్ వచ్చి అది బట్ ట్రాన్స్పోర్టేషన్ ఏమైనా డిఫికల్టీగా ఉండిందా ఏం లేదు మాది తిరుపతే కాబట్టి ఏం ట్రాన్స్పోర్టేషన్ ఏం డిఫికల్టీ లేదు కానీ బయట నుంచి వచ్చే జనాలకి కొద్దిగా డిఫికల్టీ వస్తూ అవుతుంది ఐడెంటిఫై చేయడం కష్టంగా ఉంటుంది అంటే సిటీ అవుట్స్కర్ట్స్లో ఉంది కదా కాబట్టి బస్ బస్ స్టాండ్కి రైల్వే స్టేషన్కి ఏం నియర్గా లేదు కాబట్టి కొద్దిగా డిఫికల్టీగా ఉంటుంది కానీ ఆటో సర్వీసెస్ ఉన్నాయి వాళ్ళు వాళ్ళకి ఇంట్రెస్ట్ ఉన్న కోర్సులను తీసుకొని వాళ్ళకి ఇంట్రెస్ట్ ఉంటేనే తీసుకోండి ఆ కోర్స్ అనే ఆ కోర్సును తీసుకుంటే కరెక్ట్గా ఖచ్చితంగా కంప్లీట్ చేయాలి కానీ చాలామంది ఏం చేస్తారు అంటే టెన్ పర్సెంట్ ట్వంటీ పర్సెంట్ కంప్లీట్ చేసి టూ వీక్స్ కంప్లీట్ చేసి మళ్ళీ సెవెంటీ పర్సెంట్ ఆఫ్ పీపుల్ అన్నీ ఒక కోర్సును కంప్లీట్గా కంప్లీట్ చేయరు సో దానివల్ల వాళ్ళకి యూజ్ ఉండదు కోర్స్కి తీసుకున్న దానికి యూజ్ ఉండదు అదే సో తీసుకున్న కోర్సును కంప్లీట్గా కంప్లీట్ చేస్తేనే తీసుకోండి ఆ కోర్సు కానీ చాలా యూజ్ అవుతుంది కోర్స్ మీద మై నేమ్ ఇస్ ఎమ్ నేహశ్రీ నవ్ ఐ ఎమ్ డూయింగ్ ఐ ఐ కంప్లీటెడ్ ఎంబెడెడ్ సిస్టమ్ ఇన్ ఎంపీటీఎల్ ఆన్లైన్ కోర్స్ ఐ ఎమ్ ఫ్రమ్ త్రిపుల్ ఐటీ ఆర్కే వ్యాలీ ఆర్జుకేటి ఐ ఎమ్ ఐ ఎమ్ కరెంట్లీ ఐ ఎమ్ డూయింగ్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ థర్డ్ ఇయర్ ఇన్ ఈసీఈ డిపార్ట్మెంట్ నో యాక్చువల్లీ అవర్ ఫ్యాకల్టీ డిస్ వాంటెడ్ వాంట్ దట్ యాడెడ్ దిస్ కోర్స్ ఆల్సో ఇన్ అవర్ కరికులం బట్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ బికాస్ ఆఫ్ అనదర్ ఫ్యాక్టర్స్ దే డిడెంట్ యాడ్ but uh, this is a better uh, good thing for us to know a new course from this npt year okay yeah it's better because uh, i am following every each and every week and every video from npt year it is uh, i can i can answer the questions in assignment as i completed uh, all the f- videos and okay. lectures so, actually i want to uh, get a good knowledge in iot Uh, this embedded system is also one of the part uh, for developing iot i feel it is a better uh, chance for me to improving no- skills in iot that's why i, I choose embedded system in mbtl course yeah definitely i will definitely suggest to those people why because you will get a better knowledge about different topics not just curriculum in our college and also you can improve different sides and how the uh, outside ca- uh, the competition is going to happen it, it it feels very good and you will develop your skills in different aspects not just uh, depend on marks you will definitely get knowledge you will score that that's assignments are good if you follow all the lectures you will definitely attempt every so each and every question no actually we have started our e3 same one uh, in our college that's why i'm busy with that work okay. dr divya vani yeah. i'm from tirupati okay. i have chosen uh, spectroscopic uh, analysis applications of uh, spectral analysis uh, this is actually for us this is uh, useful for cas purpose we have to do annually one refresher course so this is uh, equivalent to the uh, refresher course that's why this this is very much useful for me and i have up- upgraded my knowledge uh, related to that topic actually uh, i am giving uh, one suggestion to all the students and this is also useful for the faculty uh, if uh, we are a uh, little bit uh, weak in any particular uh, topic we have to choose that topic and we have to upgrade that uh, upgrade the knowledge uh, related to that topic ujwal Uh, SVC, uh, Chennai, uh, Wireless and Communications, uh, fourth year. Uh, actually, the thing is that we have, uh, normally we will be having six subjects, but here what they have did is that uh, doing the six subjects uh, through, on- through online is very much difficult because there will be like a lot of time spending o- uh, in the phones. So what they have did is that they have given one of the courses as, uh, uh, as an online course. Uh, we can do it in the flexi- uh, flexible times. So that's why I have chosen this course, Wireless and Communication. yeah actually to say they are easy because if you learn the lectures actually the main difficulty that we faced is that uh, we did this is the first course we are doing in nbtel so the there is like uh, uh what do you say that uh, prerequisites for the course like digital communication and everything so we didn't do the digital communication through nbtel so we we faced some problems like uh, in the basics where we didn't have a strong basics so that is the problem that we have faced uh, expect that uh, everything is fine for us okay actually to say the courses are the best for knowing about uh, the present day applications and everything 
the course give the overview of everything how the wireless communication is done and what are the concepts that are there and i guess uh, the courses that we are doing in college are uh, a bit of low grade there when compared to the courses that are doing in nbtel but the main difficulty is that uh, they are a bit of high level so if you have the basic co course if you have done the basic courses then it will be like a awesome course which gives you a best experience discussion forum uh, yeah they used to post questions and uh, the guys who know the answers normally used to post them the answers actually i didn't uh, go through it much because since we having the class groups and everything so all my class peers uh, all my peers are my classmates so we used to have whatsapp groups and everything so we didn't face any difficulty like that vinay choudhary shastra university tanjore ఈ రోజు డెవలప్మెంట్ సాఫ్ట్ స్కిల్స్ అండ్ పర్సనాలిటీ డెవలపింగ్ పర్సనాలిటీ అండ్ సాఫ్ట్ స్కిల్స్ కోర్సు పర్లేదన్న బాగానే ఉంది ఇట్స్ రియల్లీ గుడ్ ఇంకా చెప్పాలంటే ఇప్పుడు వచ్చే జనరేషన్కి వాల్యూస్ అవి ఇవి తెలియడానికి తెలియడానికి కొంచెం బాగా యూస్ అవుతుంది సో అఫీషియల్ ఈమెయిల్స్ రాయడానికి కానీ వాటికి కానీ ఎలా ఫోన్లో కాన్వర్సేషన్స్ ఎలా స్టార్ట్ చేయాలి ఎలా బిగిన్ చేయాలి ఎలా ఎండ్ చేయాలి ఇవన్నీ కొంచెం బాగా తెలుస్తుంది లేదన్న ఫస్ట్ కోర్స్ ఇది మోర్ ఆర్ లెస్ మామూలుగా ఇవి మనకి వాల్యూస్ సంబంధించింది కాబట్టి ఇది పెద్ద కేర్ తీసుకొని అయితే రాసింది కాదు కొన్ని ఎథికల్ వాల్యూస్ మనకి తెలిసి ఉంటాయి కాబట్టి జనరల్గా ఇలా అయిపోయింది ఎగ్జామ్ ఇంకా సపోజ్ ఇంకా ఫార్ ఫ్యూచర్లో ఏమన్నా రాయాలనుకుంటే ఐ వుడ్ ప్రిఫర్ టెక్నికల్ కోర్సెస్ డైరెక్ట్గా అసైన్మెంట్ నుంచి ఒక థర్టీ టు ఫార్టీ పర్సెంట్ వరకు వచ్చాయి అంటే చెప్పచ్చు థర్టీ పర్సెంట్ మ్యాక్సిమం వరకు ఇంకా మిగతావి కాన్సెప్ట్ చెప్పిన కాన్సెప్ట్కి రిలేటెడ్ ఆల్మోస్ట్ అన్ని ఇప్పుడు వరకు ఎవ్రీథింగ్ ఇస్ ఫైన్ అన్న కాకపోతే వీక్లీ కోర్సెస్ అంటే కొంచెం వీడియోస్ లెంత్ ఎక్కువ అయ్యాయని చెప్తున్నాను అంటే ఇప్పుడు మేము బీటెక్ చదువుతున్నాం కాబట్టి ఇంకా వేరే వేరే కోర్సెస్ ఉంటాయి ఇప్పుడు సెమ్ అయిపోయింది కదా వాటికి ప్రిపేర్ అవ్వాల్సి వస్తుంది సో టైం మేనేజ్మెంట్ కొంచెం కష్టం అవుతుంది ఇంకా తప్పితే ఇంకా మిగతా అంత బాగానే ఉంది ఇది వింటర్ కాబట్టి బాగానే ఉంది కొంచెం చా మా ఫ్రెండ్స్ అందరూ ఇంకా చిత్తూరు టూ అవర్స్ త్రీ అవర్స్ జర్నీ చేసి వస్తున్నారు సో ఇలా ఆన్లైన్ ఎగ్జామ్స్ అంటే కొంచెం కష్టమే డాక్టర్ అంజు ఫ్రమ్ స్విమ్స్ తిరుపతి అండ్ క్వశ్చన్స్ వెర్ గుడ్ అండ్ ఇట్ వాజ్ నైస్ టు ఆన్సర్ వి ప్రాక్టీస్ విత్ ఆల్సో యాజ్ పర్ అసైన్మెంట్ ఇట్ వాజ్ గుడ్ అసైన్మెంట్స్ వెర్ ఆల్సో గుడ్ అండ్ డెఫినెట్లీ అవుట్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ కోర్స్ వీ విల్ బి బెనిఫిటెడ్ మీన్స్ దేర్ ఈజ్ డెఫినెట్లీ ఇంక్రీజ్ ఇన్ నాలెడ్జ్ అండ్ దిస్ నాలెడ్జ్ ఈస్ నెసెసరీ for teaching students for ourselves to conduct the projects and from lectures from lectures most of the lectures and from our books nice feeling means uh, it improves the knowledge yeah. mm. no let's see not yet decided <laughs> well my name is s sai varshit uh, uh, my course is about uh, int introduction of internet things well the question paper is uh, pretty much uh, met the expectations as well there is no much uh, difficulties in the question paper as usual the strategy of uh, time was correct for the examination well hope everything was good and fine uh, i just participated in one live session yesterday i think so okay. last weekend live session well live section is uh, very important to know how the question paper will go well going to be and uh, how can expect the questions from the uh, subject wise this is an extra course for the btech of uh, engineering stream so it can be useful in uh, career uh, difficulties or uh, any interview sections like that who are hopefully on uh, computer engineering stream Inter uh, introduction to internet of thing very useful for them. no this is my first exam yeah, yeah well i'm i'm thinking to attempt uh, cyber security in the next sem reviewing every course is not just enough uh, for getting the exam mainly you should focus on uh, uh, extra things or uh, thinking out of the box about the course that will very pretty much helpful to write the exam very well actually na per govardhan reddy nenu government polytechnic college lecturer but i want to improve my subject knowledge exams rastuntanu but ee roju exam ante prathi sari idi iit val conduct chestaru kabatti course chaala manchidi not only for getting certificate we can gain some knowledge adi వెరీ వెరీ యూస్ఫుల్ ఫర్ యంగ్స్టర్స్ చెప్పాలంటే వాళ్ళు యూస్ చేసుకుంటే ఎందుకంటే అన్ని క్లాసెస్ వాళ్ళు రెగ్యులర్గా ఆన్లైన్లో విని ఎగ్జామ్ రాయడం అనేది చాలా మంచిది ఇది సో ఐ ఫీల్ వెరీ గుడ్ ఇంత ఇంతముందుగా నేను రాశాను సో బట్ టుడే ఈస్ సమ్ వాట్ ఛాలెంజింగ్ ఎందుకంటే నేను సమ్ ప్రాబ్లమ్స్ చేయలేదు ప్రిపేర్ అవ్వాలి
it's beyond my I'm not sure if but above that, I can choose to choose it. It's very nice. We'll put a manchi subject content. It is very useful for all students. How they are preparing, I don't know, but I never feel about passing the exam. I want to get better. I want to attend all questions, 100 questions, and to gain knowledge. And how they given the problem, how we are going to assess the practical situation. So, it's very challenging. Very challenging. So, I will indicate that the books refer to it, even though it is not useful for my students, but it is useful for me. I don't have to change it. Last time I was trash, I don't have to change it. So, definitely in future also I will write more exams. So, to gain the knowledge, it is very, very nice connected by the NAPTEL. Why? Because major prestigious institutions are in the courses. This is for all branches. Not only for science, for other people also, it is very, very useful. You know, students are the best source. And they will learn from here. And they will learn from here. 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 But it is very nice. So, I am telling you, it is in the future. It is a good thing. And also, it is a good thing. Youngsters की इनको अंचु में मंटे not only in terms of subject वाले career की इनके वो ना added advantage इनको जो extra इते इनके चाला मंदी दिन लो ये मंटे ride and interest चुकी थी तो आदि try दें। So my name is Dr. Ramlu. I am from Chittoor Apollo Medical College. I am associate professor in the department of anatomy. So I participate in the basic course in biomedical research. The course is very good. It helps us to know the basics of research. We just know the type of studies we are supposed to do. I prepared to the looking into the videos which are uploaded in the website of Swim NPTEL. The lectures were very good and I could comfortably understand the subject. Also, improve the knowledge on research and the exam what I today attended, it was quite comfortable and very good. No, no, no. This is the first time I am attempting you. As of now, I, uh, I have no idea because um, I have to think about it. Yeah, yeah. It is a must for every professional who is supposed to get involved in the research and uh, all should go through the such exam especially NPTML basic question biomedical research in the medical field it helps a lot for research so I suggest each and every medical professional young old or whichever the cadre or a student they are supposed to go through this course now I thank all the uh, members of uh, SOIM NPTEL who uploaded and given good knowledge to all the um, course participants and helping us out to know good, to know all the research related aspects and improving our knowledge and research thank you i am dr agvindra i am the chief of uh, super specialty services of ps super specialty hospital kupam basic uh, in medical research that is the one we have taken How is the subject? subject is very good it is very essential uh, all of our doctors from our hospital uh, have been trained in this procedure. We have been given in-house training and we have also taken the online uh, research uh, program which has been training program. We have done a very good preparation and uh, after doing good preparation uh, we have come and attended the program. We are happy about the uh, program, the way they have given the question and questions what they have given and the text uh, subscripts what they had given. The speakers have been very cordial enough and explaining about it. There is no ambiguity. I am very happy that I took this course. I am doing simultaneously other courses. Uh, one is in the nanotechnology and other one is in the prescription writing. Uh, but uh, this program uh, was very essential because uh, it was improv imp we had to submit research. So some of the research protocols and the research which we have to submit. So before that we have to finish this. So to generate the uh, quality of research and improve the research in my institute, uh, I am taking up this exam. I think I should be able to clear this exam. Um, my, uh, my answers, I think I am very confident that I will be clearing this exam. Let me see the results. <laughs> no, they are doing uh, very well. Uh, there is no much uh, thing. The only thing is, uh, if we could get a text uh, subscripts uh, for a personal use, like most of the things what they have done in the NPTEL is digital method. Like whatever the text we have to take or whatever the videos we have to take, everything is uh, online. 
but uh, if you can subscribe like if you can now my example for the basic medical research i would have been happy if i could have given a text subject which i can carry with me because many of a time uh, the signal will not be there many of a time will not be there and many doctors uh, maybe who are little uh, aged they will be happy to use a text format rather than a digital format okay the lectures can be very good uh, listening but for studying for repeating another thing if we had a text in our hand because now when i prepared i prepared my own text material and i had to download it get it printed and check because i'm happy reading in a solid hard format hard book format so if that thing they can introduce i think that will be better so the location is very good uh, i'm happy they have kept it in uh, pl good places like tirupati vellore and places where there is a uh, very good uh, convenience bus facilities and train facilities are there and also other places to visit and they kept it on sundays program is very good the staff is very good they have been very cordial the place where we are there is very good they have given even when my daughter had come they were given a security and place for her to stay when both me and my wife both doctors we had were attending they good gave a very good security I am happy the way they have conducted this program. I am Dr. Rosa Ramani from SVRR, okay. Associate Professor, Biomedical Researcher. No, no, it is very useful, but it is uh, previous days uh, also you are uh, following that uh, uh, by giving the thesis to the students, all those things. Uh, but uh, how to do the research? What is the protocol? What, uh, how, what are the procedures? Uh, how to do? What is the perfect? Uh, what percentage of perfectness is needed for the doing research. The MSc, all other uh, students, no, PhD students, yeah, they are yes, doing research. Yes, 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 they are perfect yes, in uh, doing research. Yeah, yeah. But doctors, we are perfect in treating patients. Yes, we are more bothered about disease. Yes, yes, we are uh, more concentrating on the curing. Yes, yes. But for curing, what you need? We need the what the thing useful, what yeah. is the thing which is more cure rate. Is it a, this drug, that, that drug or this uh, instrument or that instrument or that uh, cat gate, like that suture material. What, which, what is the quality, what, which is, which is more important for the curing the patient. For that you do some experiment with this, with other thing and to compare the two, two things. All this we are not bothered uh, previous days. Uh, the some uh, only ICM or uh, all research field workers, uh, biotechnology people are doing. Uh, we are believing them. Okay. But now we are, uh, um, they are encouraging doctors to do that. Okay. Because we are the um, yeah. people who cure, the, uh, take the decision to what to do, what not to do. Okay. What, uh, what, to, what the thing you are supposed to use to give the better results. Yes. For that, uh, they are increasing doctors to do the research and that is one point and in the community level also, which disease is, uh, previous days so many diseases, simple, simple things, cholera, uh, TB, all those things are, more uh, patients are died, people, are public are died. Because of research and identification of anti-tuberculous drugs, the cure rate is more, more, more. so in, in community, the common diseases are gone. Ah, yes, the yes, new yes. diseases are ah, coming. Yes, yes. <laughs> All <laughs> these are uh, more uh, aware of doctors only. What is the yeah, symptoms? Yeah. What are the uh, more uh, difficulty to treat? Uh, um, how the community is affected? Yeah. Like this. In community level also, they are increasing the research yeah. by the doctors, yeah, yeah. Yes, by yes. asking symptoms, yes, by science, yes, like yes, that. Yes. And yeah. So, we are... Uh, uh, they are making the yeah. government, uh, the central or uh, state. Uh, now AP, MR uh, are yeah. also started yes, 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 the yes, planning. Yes, that yeah, is a yeah, good yeah, idea yeah. of the government, yeah, uh, yes, even yes, central or so state. Uh, um, uh, that is uh, useful to the research orientation yes, yes. to give the better and good quality oriented services to the public. Uh, that is, uh, doctors are more time, uh, spending more time to treating now. Yeah. Uh, they want to involve the doctors to identify the which is good which is bad for the uh, for the treating the patient